Welcome to I Spy Talk, where we educate, empower, and encourage women to practice safe beauty habits, starting with their eyes and skin. I help you connect the dots between beauty and science. Some say your eyes and skin say more about you before you open your mouth. My name is Dr. Janelle O.D. I'm your host and the CEO and founder of Green Eyes Vision Center and Premier Dry Eye Spa. Thank you for tuning in. Let's chat. Hey, happy Sunday. I'm Dr. Janelle O.D., the dry eye, and dry eye mentor. Thanks for joining me on I Spot Talk. I Spot Talk, we help you connect the dots between beauty and science. I talk to industry leaders in optometry, ophthalmology, and preserve our vision and have our, our best eye life. <clears throat> so today, I'm so excited about our show today. We have two awesome optometrists that are with us today, um, and they're optometrists by day, as well as their hair. They share or wear a hat as beauty consultants. So we're going to talk to a beauty consultant from Rodan and Fields, as well as a beauty consultant from Beauty Counter. I'm here to learn as well. If you have questions, go ahead and put your questions in the comments. I'll try to do my best to make sure I'm monitoring the questions um, so that way we can have a really good experience. And I think that some of our guests today are going to have some giveaways. So without further ado, we have Dr. Christy. I'm going to add her to the stream. And then we have Dr. Sarita. I'll give a little backstory. I know Dr. Sarita from back in the day from when we both were in optometry school, struggling, one minute happy, probably next minute sad. How do we get here? How do we finish? Um, and so I'm so proud to be with her today. Christy, I know her by way of social media. I have so many social media friends. I don't know if Christy and I ever met in person, but I feel like I know you. And when we finally get to meet in person, I'm sure you're going to be at the Optometry Divas Conference this summer. Um, I got a new best friend. So don't underestimate the friends that you can make on social media. And you just add those to your friends list on the people you know from back in the day, for people that you met on social media. So we're going to get started. A lot of optometrists were excited about this conversation today. Most of us optometrists divas or you know women who are into beauty and who want to be able to have something for ourselves but at the same time an experience to give for our patients and so we're going to get started with dr christy so i'm gonna have her introduce herself kind of let us know how she got into rodan and fields and what, what's her backstory so hi everyone my name is christy wen and i've been practicing for 15 years here in orlando florida i'm a wife as well as a mom to two beautiful girls they are 10 and 12. So about four years ago, before my journey began, I was in desperate need with these short Asian lashes, um, looking for an eye product that would give me longer looking lashes. And I literally tried everything that was out there, everything that I could research, but I just couldn't find the right one. Second thing was my youngest daughter at the time was pointing at my skin one evening and asking me what those big holes were on my face. And I kind of just pause for a second and say, what are you talking about? She goes, those like right there. She literally just pointed them out in my face. And I was like, oh my gosh, I have really large pores. So being self-conscious and getting into my late thirties at the time, I just felt like I needed to cover it up. Well, that didn't help my skin. So let's speed forward. I found these amazing company that helped my skin look more youthful with just in two months, I was able to ditch my foundation and haven't touched it since then. And I actually have no facial um, makeup on at this time. This is my bare skin from this morning. And I mean, my lashes are all mine and they're much longer than where they used to be. So I'm super happy with my results. And that's why I continue to share this amazing products with my um, family and friends and patients. All right, Dr. Sarita. So tell us about yourself and how you got into Beauty Counter. Same. My name is Sarita Lawrence, and I'm originally from North Carolina, went to school at PCO with Dr. Janelle, the dry eye mentor. Um, I've been practicing for 14 years in the military, actually, so I have a, a little bit of a different path. But moving around in the military so much, it, it does a number on your skin in general. So my last duty station, I was in Ohio, and similar to Dr. Christie, like my skin just flaked out on me literally and I just started having dry patches everywhere so especially up in this area and I've always been really sensitive around my eyes anyway I had puffiness under my eyes so that was something I was used to but when it started drying out and flaking I was really really concerned um so I reached out to a mentor of mine um Ashley Capel 
And I was asking her about Beauty Counter because she was always posting about it on social media. And I was like, hmm, okay, and it's safe. They say it's safe. What does safe mean? You know, and of course, you're skeptical because it's like, I need to put something on my face, but I know my skin is really, really sensitive. Is it going to do anything for me? Is it going to benefit me? So I reached out to her, asked her for some recommendations. And this was about 2017. And after about a year of using it, she asked me, hey, do you want to join in the business opportunity? No, no, thank you. I'm not quite the salesperson. I don't like doing stuff like that. But she was just like, you know, but you use it and you tell people you use it. And it's one of those things where I jumped in literally feet first and it was just went with it because I love the products. I love what they do. And I've seen what they can do for people literally night and day. I will say this. Both you guys have beautiful skin. I can see that from afar on the camera. You guys look awesome. So I need to get my life all the way together here in the 40s. Um, it's just, and that's what I'm talking about today, just finding a routine. You know, like you said, what is safe? We see things on social media. Um, and we sometimes don't know where to begin. We don't know what to trust and who to trust. So I'm glad both of you guys are here today to share your experiences. Um, both of you guys use the products. And so that lets you know that you stand by the products that you recommend for your family members, friends, and patients. And so we'll jump right into it. So this is iSpot Talk. So we always try to gear things around how um, it affects the eye, the skin and tissue around the eye. So I'm curious to learn about products that you both have in your repertoire that are for um, what we all care about, the bags, the sagging, the darkness around and under the eye. I think that is a rite of passage. I don't remember that in my 20s, not as much in my 30s, but definitely late 30s, 40s. Some days I wake up and I'm like, did my husband hit me in my sleep? Because why am my eyes so dark? And I'm at it like, what am I going to do? You know, so let's talk about that. Let's start with Dr. Christie. And let's talk about your products that help for those dark spots and those bags underneath the eyes. So we have something called the Bright Eye Complex. It's one of my favorite ones. Um, and what it is, is it just a very small pea size, I would even say smaller than a pea size amount that you can apply right underneath your eye area. And literally within a couple of minutes for myself, actually, um, I do see a result. And the reason it works is because there's an ingredient of caffeine and lactic acid in there that helps minimize puffiness and under eye circles. And we do have samples of this. And like I said, every time I've given the sample out, even though it's just a two day sample, I get such amazing results that I normally gain a new customer from it. So that's one of the sample I'll be giving away later today. Awesome. So Dr. Sarita, do you guys have anything that's good for the dark circles and bags underneath and around the eye? Absolutely. So one of my favorites that I actually use is the Ultra Renewal Eye Cream. This same thing. You don't need a lot. I think with any of these products, the you get the most bang for your buck um, with them because you don't need a lot. And same thing, you apply it under your eye. This is good for dark circles um, and hydration in general. The one thing I love for puffiness that Beauty Counter came out with is the Eye Revive Cooling Mask. This is like a go-to that I use at least twice a week. You don't, you can only use it once a week. Um, that's what they say. Like, oh, you should only use, have to use it once a week, but you can use it as much as you want to because it's that safe. It's literally cucumber and aloe extract. And I literally use it about two to three times a week because I'll wake up and my kids will be like, did you cry last night? No, son, I didn't cry last night. And it's like, you know, it's I have these naturally just puffy eyes when I wake up in the morning. So putting those on and letting them stay up there for like 10 minutes, it does such a good job of just kind of minimizing that so I can go on about my day. So a theme that we see here is that children are brutal. So if you guys do not have children, you're listening. They are raw. <laughs> They will tell you like they see it and you got to have thick skin and then figure out, you know what, maybe I need to do something about these bags or these pores that they see. Or I have adult acne. So my kids are always, you know, the proactive commercials that come on and they were a baby and they're like, mommy, that can help. And so they, they're so innocent, but it's hilarious how kids, they're just, they're just going to tell you like it is. And so listeners, there's definitely something for those bags underneath the eye where you can wake up feeling refreshed and not worry about going to work. That's the worst thing. You know, us as working moms, we'll get where we are, daycare, dropping the kids off, get to work. And everybody's like, oh, how was your, did you sleep well last night? And you're like, wow, does my face say that I look exhausted? So I'm excited about both of these products. Um, so we're going to move forward. And so I want to find out from each one of you, 
what is your favorite product for um, skincare, anti-aging, or products? What do you, what do you, what is your go-to, and what do you always tell your clients and patients about? We'll start with Dr. Christy. Well, one of my favorite one is going to be our Active Hydration Serum. It contains the similar um, ingredients as our Bright Eye Complex, but it's about 10% glycerin and hyaluronic acid. And even though there's 10% glycerin, it is not sticky on the skin when it's applied. And you literally, it comes in an amazing cute little bo um, bottle like this, and it comes in the droplet. And it has just enough amount in there for you to hydrate the entire face. The reason I really like this product is literally you can see instant results, um, up to 200% hydration with just the very first use. And the more hydrated your skin is going to um, look, it's going to just feel also very um, youthful as well. And it creates a reservoir of hydration on your skin for up to eight hours a day, just continually drawing moisture from the atmosphere and layer on your skin, giving you that beautiful pregnancy glow without the pregnancy parts. <laughs> so yes, without the pregnancy part. So yeah, I know I'm, I'm done. I my two, one of each. So I need the glow, but without the actual reason for the glow. So Dr. Sarita, let's talk about your favorite products. What are your go-tos? What do you always recommend for family members, friends, and patients? Oh man, I have a list. Well, we'll start since we're talking about glow. We'll talk about sunshine in a bottle. This is my favorite, favorite thing. The way that it smells, the way that you literally instantly see the glow. It's called the All Bright C Serum, and it's vitamin C, ten percent vitamin C. Um, and it's literally sunshine in a bottle. You put it on, it hydrates and moisturizes, but it gives you that extra glow without you having to do anything else to your face. And the smell, oh my God, it just wakes you up in the morning. So this is like my go-to every morning. And when I ran out of it, I was going around searching for, I was like, I know I have a sample. I know I have a sample because it's something that I'm not used to going without. And it took me two days to find my sample. And the difference between those two days, between the glow and I felt like my skin was starting to go back dull again. I'm like, no, I refuse. Like this, this is my go-to, I promise. <laughs> So what I noticed, both of you guys get very elated and happy when you're talking about this. So um, beauty is, you know, some people try to make beauty a bad thing, but beauty is a form of self-care. So especially with women, when we feel good or we look good, we feel good. Um, if we feel not self-confident, I mean, self-conscious about our skin, we're, we're a different person and there's nothing wrong with that. So I like the fact that you guys both brighten up when you talk about your regimens and things that you recommend for your patients. And so people that are listening, I know when I mention beauty things to, to patients, you know, you want to talk about how to enhance your beauties, but also be safe at the same time, but they kind of get overwhelmed. So I kind of want to talk about kind of your routine. How do you go through with implementing these products and these routines in your morning or night routine? And that's a real discussion because most of us are working moms. We have children. And I know for me, when I want to do my night routine, I got to look, it's like, okay, I'm going to be in bed at 10. I need to start about 9.45, 9.30. But I have fun with it. You know, I sit there, I take my time. I close the door. It's my me time. So let's talk about some of your, how do you incorporate this into your everyday um, and give some tips to some of the listeners who may be looking to start a skincare regimen. Let's start with Dr. Sarita. So one of the things that I always tell people is you want to start with a clean palette. So if there are two steps that I think that you have to do in your beauty routine and your regimen is clean and protect. So you start off with a good cleanser. Um, for me, I like to use our counter match line because my skin is normal to dry. Um, some days it gets on the drier side. So I use our counter match foaming cleanser to start off with. And then if you want to incorporate more steps with that, then you can talk about prepping and treating your skin. So the prep statement, prep like a uh, part of the regimen is more so you're using a toner and different lines have different toners that you use. And that just allows your skin to absorb whatever products you're about to put on it. The next step is where you use a serum. So the serum is going to add more hydration to your skin. <clears throat> it's going to treat your skin for whatever you're looking for. Do you want to have your pores get smaller? Are you trying to target fine lines and wrinkles? What is it that you're trying to get to in that particular regimen? And for my day and night when it's a little bit different, so most of the time in the daytime, I'll use, like I said, my um, C serum. At nighttime, I'll use I'll alternate. I'll use our resurfacing peel because it's kind of like doing a little facial and that retextures and resurfaces your skin, but it gives you that softness um, that you want overnight. And then the final step, you protect it. You want to use some type of moisturizer throughout the day. Your 
face goes through so much just in the environment. So any of those stressors that we go through when the dirt, especially out here in New Mexico, it's super windy during monsoon season. It's rocks flying everywhere. So if you make sure that you literally have some type of moisturizer with it. So this is the adaptive moisturizer that I use during the daytime. And it, we have a night cream that I use at night. It's a little bit thicker, so it protects your skin even more as you sleep. Dr. Christy, so let's give us, you know, talk to us a little bit more about your routine and how to help women and patients not feel overwhelmed with adding these products. So the good thing about um, Rodana Fields is they do customize their regimens to very simple steps that's numbered one, two, and three. So it makes your life super easy because my thing was before I started was I didn't know what to use and what order to use it. And so all these products are formulated to, for you to use basically the right ingredients in the right concentration in the right um, order will give you results. And that's what we promise. Because again, they've already tested this. So for my morning routine, it's just a cleanser, a toner, and then a moisturizer with SPF. Always SPF, because that's the most important thing. Sun damage is the number one reason people get sun damage, sun um, wrinkles, um, acne, sensitive skin, literally all the four main things our skin has to go through throughout the entire year. Then the only difference is at night, it's just, again, a cleanser, a toner, and a moisturizer without a sunscreen. Super easy, just three steps. Again, you can implement any of the eye serum or eye cream or the lash boost, which is, again, a lash enhancement serum that I mentioned earlier. But literally, just keep it really simple. Anything else, again, it's all extras that we can definitely incorporate into your routine. At the beginning, I was using something called the AMP MD Roller in our Intensive Renewal Serum. What it does is it basically help further minimize pores and wrinkles by doing this procedure at home. Um, this is a high concentration of vitamin A, which helps again, firm that skin for further tightening. So that's why I saw my results so much quicker at the very beginning. And this is uh, formulated so it's safe for even people who have acne or sensitive skin. And this is another great product to add to your regimen. It's super simple to use. So again, my routine literally last less than five minutes in the morning and at night but i do like to take my time and just like go a little bit slower because it's my me time and it's where i'm just like you know my calmness in the morning and at night just for myself so even though it only takes five minutes i've been playing my music in the background just kind of like going really slow in the steps just enjoying every step of it yeah definitely self-care my staff mm -hmm. uh, one of my goals in 2021 was to to take more time for myself. You know, it can get really busy. So my staff bought me one of these mirrors to have a light, candles. And um, so I go in the bathroom for my evening regimen and I turn the music on. I have the candles in the mirror. And my husband's like, what do you do? I'm like, oh, this is my time. I have a bathrobe on. You think I'm in a spa. Um, so yes, definitely. It's a great way for, you know, busy working moms to kind of find time for themselves and to work on enhancing our beauty. I do want to spend a little bit of time here, Dr. Christy. I want you to talk a little bit more about that roller. Um, can you tell us a little bit more about that? Of course. So our AMP MD roller basically comes with over 200 micro, uh, laser um, tip needles or tips. And what it is, is it gently micro exfoliate your skin and creates these micro channels so that your products and your treatment gets deeper into your tissue. So it's more effective in terms of penetrating your skin. This is safe enough that you actually can use it every single day, but only for the anti-aging regimen or the sun damage regimen. Uh, for people who have sensitive skin or acne, again, your skin is too irritable. This is not recommended for that. But we always follow up immediately with, like I mentioned, our intensive renewal serum. This packs a huge um, punch because, again, this is vitamin A without a prescription packed into this little capsule. The reason for that is because they found that um, vitamin A oxidized very quickly. So by keeping it individualized like this, as soon as you open it and apply it to your skin, which feels like velvet, um, it literally just gives the full potency of this serum, which like I said, can be used on people who do have sensitive skin. Um, so I really, really love it. it. Like I said, it's a lifesaver and it's so simple to use just up and down, side to side and diagonal. You can even use this down to your neck and your cholera area if you're sagging there, which some of us do. And it literally takes about a minute and it's so fun. It feels really good. Cool. Um, so I have a question too. So for a lot of these things, how do patients or family members and friends know how to get started? 
are their surveys? Um, who do they talk to? How do they know which regimens they should begin with? Is there a for beginners, for advanced, you know, acne? How do people know where to start with Beauty Counter or where to start with Rodan and Phil? So let's start with Dr. Serena first. So Beauty Counter actually does have a skin quiz and it asks you four things. It asks you a few things. So one, what is your skin type? Are you oily? Are you combo? Are you normal? Are you dry? And then what's your primary concern? Are you concerned about blemishes? Are you concerned about dryness? Are you concerned about under eye area? So it'll go into a few of those and then ask you what your secondary concern is as well. And then with that, it'll formulate, a, um, it'll use your information to, to tell you which regimen it recommends, whether it's counter time, counter match, um, counter control, which is the one that we use for oily skin and for acne, or we have one that's counter start. And it's really simple for sensitive skin has four ingredients that they base it off of. Dr. Christy. So Rodanville's also have a solution tool, simple two minute quiz that asks about your age, your skin type, um, your skin concern, a primary and a secondary so that we can further customize your products. You do get a copy of that email. We get a copy of it. And I always follow up with my customers to see if there's any additional um, issues they may have that they didn't mention. So again, key ingredient here is you always want to address the sensitivity first, which a lot of people don't realize that they do have, but they don't consider that their initial primary issue. So again, we always want to make sure that if you have sensitive skin, that's always addressed first. Otherwise, all the other products would not work. That's a good point. Now, these things that they're that they're doing, are they able to do these in conjunction if they're under the care of a dermatologist, if they see an esthetician regularly for facials? Are all these things collaboratory or it's kind of like we do this or we with a dermatologist? Can, can they work all together? Dr. Christie. So, of course, you can um, work with other professionals. But again, these products, again, the reason they work well is because all the ingredients are formulated to work together so that's more effective and so the results will be there. But when you mix and match products, that's where it gets a little bit tricky because not all the ingredients from this brand is going to match another brand. Because um, I've I've experienced that firsthand and I know that it does wreak havoc on your skin when you're mixing matching so many products from different companies because they're not all made together. And the reason I love this brand is that everything that they formulate is compatible with each other. You, Yes, you can work and see your esthetician or your dermatologist. But again, once you start using the products, it is best to stick with within that family of products. Dr. Sarita? Yeah, same thing with Beauty Counter. You want to kind of stay within the family of products that you're using based off of the things that can counter what preservatives are in things or what, you know, how it was formulated. What is the base for it? Is it a retinal complex? You know, we're not using retinol. We're using a retinal natural complex. And then we use an alpine Swiss rose with it. But are you allergic to any of those things? Some people are allergic to uh, coconut or avocado. Mm -hmm. But some of the products that we use because we're trying to stay in that safe realm of products, it'll have some of those things in it. And our uh, clients could be allergic to those. So it's important for us to have full disclosure about what's in that and be just transparent for what's in the products. Definitely full disclosure. And, you know, that's just with any, you know, we both are, we're all providers. So patients, you know, they'll come to us and not tell us about certain things that they're doing or taking. Cause sometimes they're like, what does that have to do with, you know, coming for this appointment? But a lot of times they don't realize it. So same thing, if they're taking these products, you know, or using these products and they're under the care of a dermatologist or esthetician, they should be disclosing that information. So that way you can get the best results, the best outcomes and that everybody's just on the same page. So let's go back to fun stuff. So let's talk about makeup. I know Beauty Counter has makeup as well. Rodan and Phil's has some things that Chrissy's going to talk about as well. But let's start with Dr. Sarita first. Talk about makeup. That's where we get a lot of questions. You know, what, what makeup do you recommend and what makeup options are available through Beauty Counter? So for makeup, we have foundation, we have concealer, we have blush, eyeshadows, we have a full array. The thing I do like about Beauty Counter's makeup is that it's also skincare in that same bottle. So they have products in it that are going to help with elasticity, help with the firmness, and help with the hydration, especially with the new Skin Twin Foundation. I personally don't wear a lot of makeup. <laughs> so I do, the. Uh, we have a Dew Skin and it's an SPF, like just a tinted moisturizer. I use that as some concealer and then I'm like out the door. But with our Flawless in 5, you can literally do your makeup and I've seen our, our troopers do it in like two minutes and 18 seconds flat because they're like, yes, I know what I'm doing. I got it. And they're out. 
And me personally, I just, I want something really, really simple. I like Dew Skin because it has the SPF in it. It gives you a very, very light coverage. And like I said, I'm always conscious about what's around my eyes. So I use our concealer. Um, this a not grass extract formula with it. So it is hydrating. It doesn't dry you out. It's not forming in the creases of your eyes. And I know a lot of people had that issue with concealers as well. So it keeps those crow's feet away, minimizes those fine lines and wrinkles. Those are my absolute two favorite for makeup though. Now, is there any mascara that is offered under the um, beauty counter? We do. We have volumizing and lengthening mascara. We're coming out with something new. Shh, don't tell anybody. <laughs> so, and I love that. It's like beauty counter is always on that edge of reformulating stuff and repackaging things to make it environmental friendly and coming up with new products where you can get your all in one type deal that a lot of people are looking for. We don't have time to go switch from four different things to get a look. We need one thing, put it on and let's go. Yeah, definitely. I get a lot of questions about what's a good mascara. So that's definitely good to know. Um, moisturizer tint with SPF is, yes, a working woman's um, savior. I know Rodan and Fields has something like that as well. So I'll let Dr. Christy have a moment to talk about what makeup options are available, if any, through Rodan and Fields. So we, um, again, we're all concentrating mostly on skin care. So we don't have makeup, but we do have something called a radiant defense. What this is, is a tinted, an instant perfector. Think of it that way. It's only not only protects your face from harsh environments, but it um, has an SPF of 30. There's currently 10 different shades and it literally applies in seconds. So normally, again, it's just a small amount that you would apply in your brush. And literally, as you brush it on, it instantly just smooth out your skin and it instantly just gives your skin that beautiful glow. I've actually applied this when I meet people when before we had masks and people would see me in real in real life and they were like, wow, your skin is flawless. It doesn't look like makeup and that's the beauty of it. It looks like your second skin and it's so light. It doesn't clog your pore. It doesn't cause you to break out. I absolutely love it because again, it just gives you the option of having that Flawless look if you're not ready yet. So again, our goal is to get patient, um, customers and patients to basically love the skin they're in so they're, they don't have to be, be hit, hiding behind makeup or concealers. So this is our, 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 our product to offer people who are not quite there and they want just a little bit of that coverage. Um, one of the other things that we came out recently is our brow defining boost. I don't have that up here because I forgot about it, but I am wearing the um, the dark color at this time, but what it does is it instantly just feels in your brows, giving you that instant fullness and darkness and color. And over time, even without the product, it looks fabulous. So that's one of our other one. And at some point, if you have really light brows um, or even lashes, you can actually, if, you know, I've applied it to my, my lashes too. So. So this is great. Um, couple questions. Um, one, in real time, you know, when we're using these products, a lot of us want things instantaneously, just like we do with any regimen. You know, they start a dry eye regimen and they're like, I did everything you told me to do. And on Monday, it's Thursday. My eye doesn't feel any better. It's like, ma'am, sir, it took months to get here. It's going to take months for things to get better. So what is a realistic time frame for when we're doing these things to enhance our beauty that patients and clients and family members and friends will start to see a realistic possible change in their appearance? or enhancement in their appearance. Let's start with Dr. Sarita. So usually what I tell people is give it a couple of weeks, you know, like be consistent. And I think consistency is the key across the board. So that's why I tell them a couple of weeks. Not that I think it's going to take them that long. I've had people tell me, you know, I was talking to my boyfriend and he noticed that I was using a moisturizer lotion and he noticed it. And I'm like, Good, but is it consistent? Because that one time glow that you get, that's wonderful. But what we're trying to do is make sure that your skin is clearing up if you've had issues, if you've had patches, and that that glow is a constant glow, not anything that's just one second instantaneous. So I always tell people a couple of weeks because I want them to get into the habit of doing this and making it a habit and making it a part of their just day to day and not thinking that I'm going to do one pump, put it on my face, and then smile and everything's going to be perfect. It's not. And I always tell people, it's not even just about using the products. It's about what we're putting in our body too. Drinking, making sure you're drinking enough water, you're eating vegetables and eating fruit. All of that's important as well. I can give you all the beauty counter in the world, but if you're not putting the right stuff inside your body, beauty counter's not going to fix that. 
That is so true. So true. And I'm still, I struggle with that. You know, being a provider, we're on the go. We're jumping from patients to patients. And, you know, I'm, I lack on my water intake and I could definitely tell when I'm not. And so I'm like, I'm literally having to start coming in an exam room with a water bottle. Like, look, I'm going to have to drink this in between because otherwise I can't get my water intake for the day. And I have it sitting over here now, but at work, I just get going and, you know, and I can tell when I'm not conscious about really drinking water. Um, so that's a good point. It, you know, we can do all the aesthetic things outward, but we have to be very conscious of what we're taking in. Um, and also, you know, our sleep, our stress levels, all those things do pay a role. So Dr. Christie, um, your feedback. So we're sticking just to the skincare. Um, then I would say again, consistency is key. And a lot of time I have to explain to the uh, customers that, again, your skin takes 60 to 90 days for the cells to turn over. So if you're looking for sun damage transformations or even anti-aging uh, transformations, it's going to take that skin that time to turn over for you to actually see the results. And that's why most of our products are made to last for at least two months of continuous use of twice a day as well. Um, so because again, it does take that time. I mean, it took all that those years to accumulate all those issues. It's not going to disappear overnight. We do have some amazing products that do give instant results. But if you're looking for long term results, that again, is going to take time for all that issue to be um, treated. And so the products, again, you know, I want to have them make sure they're realistically understanding how the products work and what to expect for each of the different regimens that we do offer. That's a good point. A realistic time frame, um, just like in my clinic when I'm treating patients with dry eyes, it's 30, 60, 90 program. You know, most before then, but on average, around 90 days is when you're going to start to see a light at the end of the tunnel and being consistent. You always have to do your part. And so let's talk about, because we're all here optometrists. And so do we offer or do you offer these products during your exam at any point? Or do you wait for um, patients to ask you about it? Or do you have questionnaires? Or is this only something that you do outside of the office that's kind of like a side thing for you? So let's talk about that a little bit. Um, let's start with Dr. Sarita. How does this fit into your optometry world, if it does at all? For me, it, it, it's all outside. With the military, I have rules and regulations that I have to abide by. So I don't bring anything outside and personal that could drive an income, that could drive anything or influence because of my rank either um, into the clinic at all. So if there's something that I'm posting on social media and somebody sees it and they ask me about it, oh, it's, it's game on. I'm telling you everything I know about Beauty Counter and showing you what works. Then, hey, do you need a sample? What can I do to help? It's, it's, it's a very, very distinct border between what I do with beauty counter versus what I do with optometry. But it doesn't stop me from telling people about, hey, you know, this when especially when false lashes thing came out and telling people about that and what that can cause. And, hey, you need to make sure you're changing this out and the bacteria, the infection. So it's I, I'm very serious when I like tell people, OK, I noticed that your eyeliner is covering all of your mybomian glands like that. It irks my soul. So I'll tell them. But a lot of them like, well, I've had male doctors before and nobody's ever bothered to say that. So thank you for telling me that. So I, I th that part of the consultant naturally comes out of me, especially in my female patients, because I want them to know I don't want you coming in here talking about I got a side or I have this going on. I have this irritation when we can prevent that as long as you know the correct way to apply your makeup. Are you changing it out? I have friends and family members that'll be like, oh, my mascara is like 10 months old. Oh, oh my God. No, please don't. And they'll be like, I know you're going to fuss at me as long as you know. OK, so and I, I try to do things and just give that education and that that love and encouragement and that feedback to tell them that, hey, we have to do better. <laughs> I agree. Um, I, we're, we're looking under the microscope. And so whether we have a product to offer right then and there, it is our duty to educate. Um, I so, you know, other optometrists, the skin and tissue around the eyes, we should own that. And so I make it a habit myself as well. When I see something that's like, you know, the liner covering the entire my bobing glands on the lower lid, it's like, oh my God, or makeup that I see that I can tell has been on there for a couple of days. So I'll initiate the conversation. So what do you use to remove your mic your makeup? And most women are very appreciative. Um, a lot of things they just don't know. Bad habits are passed down from sister, mom, grandma, or friends. And so taking that extra step to educate a patient um, on all aspects of their eye care health is important. So Dr. Christie, how does this fit into your optometry space or if it does at all? So I'm an independent contractor, so I work for other doctors. So it is not in my best interest to offer these to the patients if, you know, on a daily basis. However, there are exceptions when a patient is suffering and I know that there is a product that I can offer to help them. I would 
fully disclose to them that this is my side hustle. Um, I'm with this company and they do have something that I, I feel that it's going to help you. And I think one most memorable um, patient would be somebody who had acne rosacea, who had really dry eyes, um, really red, irritated eyes. And they were young. This was a young male in his 20s. And he's been suffering with rosacea, didn't really know it was rosacea. He just knew that it was red and his eyes were always irritated. And he was a contact lens wearer. So I told him, you know, we do have some products. And again, this is not anything that's endorsed by the doctor I work for or the company that we're with, but it's something I do on the side. And I think it's going to help you out. Would you be willing to try it? And he said, yeah, I've tried everything. Like I've been to my dermatologist, nothing has helped. So we do have a line called Soothe and that really helps calm the skin. And it just recently been, you know, approved for psoriasis treatment and eczema and, 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 and also rosacea. So it's something that this patient did try and it actually helped with his rosacea and it helped with his dry eyes and it helped with his contact lens wear. And he texts me after just a couple of days of using it that his, his face and his eyes just felt so much better. And he was so appreciative. And then I think his mom later joined as a consultant. Um, but again, it was just like, it was so funny. Um, but yeah, it was just one of those experiences that, you know, when you know you have a product that can help, like I said, I don't come out and advertise it, but if it comes across and they really need it, now I'll just fully disclose before I go any further. I say, well, you know, this is my side hustle. And that I do offer them that if they wanted more information, but I never push it on them because again, it's not part of, of what I can offer it since I, it's not my office. Sorry, we had a little bit of internet issues there, but I totally get it. So yeah, so it's not nothing wrong with having a side hustle, but at the same time, you know, sometimes you kind of have to just be like, hey, talk to me outside of the office. I have something that may be able to help help you. And then any optometrists that are listening, definitely if you are more control of the space or the owner of the space, you might have a little bit more liberty as to when and how you can offer these products to a patient. And so side hustle. So it's always important to have a side hustle. Um, if anything, tell us, then tell us that it was COVID. So if, if anybody has some way of bringing other ways of revenue into the household, um, you felt a little bit, um, a little more at ease during that time frame when, you know, most of us had to shut down at some point and not be able to see patients or work or laid off. And so anyone that's listening out here, whether they are a client who wants to start using Beauty Counter or Rodan Fields or someone who wants to use and maybe use it as a way to bring in another source of revenue for their household, how do they get started? Let's start with Dr. Sarita literally just reach out. The opportunity is there. So if, if you have questions, you're not sure, you want samples, or you just want to come to a couple of calls, our team always does calls to bring people in and show them the business side of it, to show them it's a family. Once you get a team um, of women, especially that that it's, it's a family. You literally throw ideas off each other. Hey, I need help with this. What do you think about this? It You come, become a part of something so much bigger than yourself and you're never left alone. You always have somebody to call on. It doesn't matter, text, hey, I need, I, I need help with, can you please, somebody's always gonna ping up with you and say, hey, let me help you, or this is the answer, or this is where you can go find it, or hey, let's find out together, because we don't know everything, you know? And I think just the transparency of that, it, it makes it so much easier that you don't feel like you're on your own with it. Definitely, so another way to get a family or friends, a circle of women who are supporting you in, in your entrepreneurship journey is always a plus. Dr. Christy. So they can always just reach out to me. I'm super easy to find on social media if you haven't already connected with me. Um, but it literally, you know, it's so simple. And just like Beauty Counter, we have a great easy way to get started with Rodan and Fields. It takes less than 10 minutes to have your virtual business up and going with your own personal lives website so people can start shopping and join you in business. We have a great um, you know, incentives right now to the end of the month for anybody joining. We get freebies. Um, it's just a great community of like-minded individuals. I've met so many wonderful people through this opportunity. And even within this opportunity, it's led to me expanding my entrepreneur um, journey, which I've, again, took off last year in 2020. So I can't imagine where I'd be if I did not um, say yes 
four years ago to this opportunity. So I'm just so excited. But again, it's just a great community, lots of information out there. Um, and it's just very simple. And again, a lot of times I just get you on the phone and we just start talking to see if this is a good fit. Because again, at the end of the day, if it's not a good fit, then it doesn't matter how wonderful the opportunity is. If it's not something that aligns with what your values are or what you're looking for. But it doesn't hurt to try. You got 60 days or your money back. So why not? Yeah, you said it doesn't hurt to try. And it's important. Like I said, everything is not a fit for everybody. So it's important for those that are individuals that are interested in trying the products or even the, um, the business aspect of it. Just to make sure you reach out, get as much, much information as you can so that way you can feel like it's a fit. But I will tell you, you both have inspired me to get my life all the way together because I'm looking at y'all skin like I really need to get consistent be a better patient, a better client, you know, make sure I do the things daily and don't expect to turn around in three days. Um, but this is my year to focus on myself more. So it should be an easier fit this year. Um, you guys do have your Instagram um, handles on the page, but just quickly let patients and clients and everybody that's listening know how they can find you guys so they can reach out to start this journey. You guys both mentioned um, samples. So I'm sure if anybody's interested in trying some of the product, getting some samples before they get started, um, tell them how they can reach you guys. Dr. Sarita. Um, definitely IG on Facebook. I am Sarita. You can see how my first name is spelled. Daniels Lawrence. And then um, you can email me, sarita.beautycounter at gmail.com. Um, you can also call me or text me. I'm an open book, so I can get you my information through Dr. Janelle. Awesome. Dr. Christy. So as you can see, my Instagram handle is your underscore skin girl. Uh, you can also find me under Christy Wynn on Facebook as well as LinkedIn. I do have some amazing samples too. My favorite products is again, the Bright Eye um, the Bright Eye Complex, this one here, there's a two day sample as well as our active hydration serum, which is a three day sample of that instant hydration on your skin. So I have these two for those who are interested, they can just send me a quick message of which one they prefer and I'll get that out to you next week. Next week. Well, I once again, I thank you ladies for joining me. Um, people that are listening, as usual, you'll be able to find this on our YouTube channel, Dr. Janelle, the Dry Eye Mentor, so that way you can listen to this at your leisure. But these optometrists are awesome. They are awesome, awesome, awesome. Um, thank you for taking your time out of your busy schedules to join me this evening. And I hope that you are inspired to start your entrepreneurship journey or to start your anti-aging skincare journey. Do like me, get your life all the way together. We have about six, seven months left in 2021 to hit 2022 looking good. I'm trying not to look like I'm in my forties. Um, so uh, you guys have inspired me. I'm going to go right online when I finish and get my stuff together so that I can be ready for this summer. But once again, thank you for joining us and we're going to be ending our show now. <laughs>